trucks passing through Troop County caused 15 road closures. Most closed due to flooding like this one on Floyd Road. And two roads washed away completely. But the damage to Whitesville Road seems to be the most troubling. This is our major concern right here. Sergeant Stuart Smith says the damage to Whitesville Road could be a problem for the unforeseeable future. We've noticed what appears to be almost like a cave is opened up underneath the road, and so we've had to shut it down for safety purposes until the state can get here and assess things. This is a major artery from LaGrange, Columbus, and points north and south as well. Now drivers are trying to figure out how to get around it. Really, I got to get home. <laughs> oh. I got to go that oh. way. Get around that. What do you got to do now? Go a long way around. How much more time is that going to take? About. 30 minutes. Tammy Ernest says she's surprised to hear about the damage the storm caused. I mean, it's been worse, but I don't know. I just I didn't figure that much rain fell.